Seven feet tall, over 350 pounds. The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Lagos, Nigeria. Weighing in at 350 pounds, Commander Aziz. Commander Aziz rose quickly through the ranks of the Imperial Army and looks as though he's about to ascend through WWE's roster just as quickly. Just a towering and intimidating presence when Commander Aziz enters the arena. Yeah, now we're talking. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 268 pounds, Irvin. I won't pretend this competitor hasn't done some exceptional things, but I am not referring to them by the new nickname they keep pushing. Seriously? I think the name the absolute best ever at this, no questions asked, is a totally reasonable idea. You would, wouldn't you, Corey? He says it's all about dominance tonight and plans on showing why everyone backstage should be scared. What type of approach does a superstar need in order to win a matchup like this, Corey? It's important to remember that you can't win a match like this on emotion alone. You have to devise a plan and execute it. Once locked in the cell, we've seen superstars embrace a new, sadistic level of barbaric behavior. I agree, Byron, and it's all out of necessity. Take off! Diving elbow right on point. Now on the outside, right by those cell walls. Now we're talking. This sledgehammer might be what decides this match. And he goes into the ring. And now in the most dangerous area inside the cell. With an uppercut. Ooh. Oh! Sharp punch. Aziz able to counter. Oh! Oh! Oh, man! Oh, man! Overhand hits him with the counter. Oh man. Oh. Catches an uppercut. This is not good. They say the cell brings out the worst in people, but even I didn't see that coming. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Oh, no, Robbie. He's got something in mind here. I don't think I wanna know what it is. Remember, though, what goes up must come down, and sometimes it's the coming down part that gets you. This match grinded him down a little. Ooh. 
Caught square by the Haymaker. Oh, solid for him. The most iconic Hell in a Cell match was Undertaker versus Mankind. But remember the first one? Undertaker and Shawn Michaels, the appearance of Kane that night. So much WWE history tied to this sadistic structure. as intimidating as the hell in a cell. How does a superstar get over the menacing cell? I don't know if you can get over it, Cole. It's an evil structure with no easy way out. We've seen that superstars who thrive in the cell are the ones that embrace the carnage. Yeah. Oh, this is where this match becomes so dangerous. Ladies and gentlemen, we're... That should do it right there! One, two, no! A two count! This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Sledgehammer connects. I will scramble your insides. Any one of these attacks. And he denies his ease. Man, what a push. Producing a trampoline. And the commander is keeping the match at his pace. Aziz has his anger fueling him now. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. I will scramble your insides. Aziz will not come back from that. Cover! One, two, three. They got it. A career-changing win inside Hell in a Cell. Here is your winner, Irvin R. Shiger. And this victory is one for the record books. With a win like that, you have to stand back for a moment and realize all your hard work paid off.